25 best Wii racing games. Good work, Zach. Looks like you still know how to handle the vehicle. Number 25, GT Pro Series. The last thing the Wii needs is GameCube ports of mediocre games. This system should have original titles that make use of the Wii remote and hardware from the ground up. Not old GameCube games that weren't worth a look in the first place. Number 24, Wake Your Races, Crash and Dash. If you're a diehard fan of the animated series, developer Ido Sweden has managed to capture some of its charm with this simple, shallow racer. Younger audiences might get a brief kick, but racing fans should look elsewhere. Fun for young gamers, but no substance as a real racing game. Double zero duo are up to something. Number 23, Emergency Mayhem. This isn't one of those titles that people will be talking about for years, and it won't likely make an appearance on any list of top sellers. But it's still an enjoyable experience that you shouldn't miss if you're looking for something different on Wii. Number 22, Donkey Kong Barrel Blast. Donkey Kong Barrel Blast is a strange beast full of half-baked ideas and poor controls, yet it contains deceptively clever level designs. Like Kirby Air Ride, it will probably find a small audience of gamers who can put up with its many serious flaws in order to extract some juicy gameplay nectar that few others will ever know. <laughs> Number 21, Emergency Heroes. For a game that features an open environment and cool futuristic rescue vehicles, Emergency Heroes is a bland and uninspiring racing game for the Nintendo Wii. Sure, the vehicles drive decently enough, but the performing the same missions repeatedly do not equal a fun time. Our Emergency and Rescue Heroes deserve better than this. Number 20, Nitro Bike. All told, it almost seems as if Nitro Bike's driving mechanics and track design were pulled from two completely different games. They simply don't fit, and that lack of harmony results in a frustratingly difficult experience. If that weren't enough, insult is added to injury when you consider what little incentive there is for battling through this mess. Need for Speed Undercover. When compared to other racing games available in the highly competitive genre, Need for Speed Undercover is way off the pace. The Wii version has a lackluster presentation with tired graphics that really doesn't do the console justice. Whilst the controls, sound, and handling are good, it's ultimately let down by the numerous other problems. Number 18, Monster 4x4 World Circuit. Monster 4x4 isn't long or deep enough to be a must own, but racing fans will derive a day or two's worth of pleasure. The courses are short and usually sweet, and the controls are intuitive without being overly sensitive, paving the way for wee newbies who might not be used to the console's motion controls. Number 17, Jumbo Safari Animal Rescue. As an arcade experience, Jumbo Safari was a decent bit of fun. Attempting to expand it into a home game hasn't been that a great success. Poor decisions in the wardrobe department, tedious animal treatment sections, and useless party games take a lot away from what could have been a pretty fun game to play with your kids. Ah! 
Number 16. Sonic Riders Zero Gravity Sonic Riders Zero Gravity can be a very enjoyable title. Although it's certainly not a fully fledged racing game, nor is it anything like a snowboarding game, since it sits somewhere in the middle of the two genres. Sonic fans might be annoyed with another spin off title, but if embraced correctly, they should still get a lot out of this title. Number 15, Heracles Chariot Racing. Lacking any realistic sense of the story of Heracles or the experience of chariot racing, this game would at first glance seem to be a disappointment. However, what we have instead is a passable Mario Kart clone that offers some new twists to its racing and some new battle mode levels to play with your friends. <laughs> Number 14, Need for Speed Pro Street. One can safely assume that petrol heads accustomed on the original NFS have most likely progressed to Gran Turismo, Forza Motorsport, and Project Gotham Racing. The Wii lacks a pure racing game in the same vein as these genre classics, and while Pro Street can hope to compete, it's an acceptable substitute until true racing savior appears on Nintendo's machine. Number 13, Need for Speed Carbon. Need for Speed Carbon for the Wii falls a bit flat in certain areas, but it's a good attempt at bringing us a fresh new twist to this underground racing series. While it doesn't surpass most wanted, the series still has some challenging races. Those who are looking for an innovative racing game with the Wii remote will not be disappointed. Number 12, Cars. Though Cars will almost certainly take you well under 10 hours to complete, there's two player multiplayer to mess with, as well as some bonus materials to check out. Of course, all that and just about everything else positive that can be said about Cars for the Wii can also be said about its cheaper counterparts on old generation consoles. Number 11, F1 2009. If you're looking for an arcade style racer with a Formula 1 badge, then F1 2009 may fit the bill and is likely to keep you busy for quite some time. Unfortunately, if you're looking for a game that captures the essence and challenge of the pinnacle of motorsport, you're going to be disappointed. Number 10, Speed Racer. Speed Racer at its core is an amazing game, with great depth, control, and nice difficulty progression. Perhaps the developer will use this great engine for another title with more inspired track design, better graphics, and a more fully featured package overall. Number 9, NASCAR Kart Racing. When everything is said and done, NASCAR Kart Racing is a solid racing title that'll appeal to any type of gamer. The game supports the same four control schemes as Mario Kart Wii and will provide gamers with an enjoyable racing experience. If you were a fan of Mario Kart, you may find some enjoyment in NASCAR Kart Racing. Number 8, My Sims Racing. My Sims fans and players in general will find something to enjoy in My Sims Racing. Features such as charming humor, likable characters, a soft clean look, and car customization options give the experience a personal touch. It might not last you very long, but if you give My Sims Racing a chance, you will find a solid and enjoyable racing experience.
number 7 excite bike world rally with more tracks more bonus features and more strategic racing challenges excite bike world rally is a racing game that will keep you challenged with its ever increasing difficulty and entertain with its track editor not only does this remake vastly improve on its original formula but also it provides a more polished and enjoyable racing experience than any other game Number 6. Need for Speed Nitro Need for Speed Nitro is a good looking game that boasts a dizzying sense of speed at all the right moments. You're provided with plenty of opportunities to leave your mark on the tracks with a good dose of interesting gameplay that is, for the most part, a lot of fun. Five, Excite Truck Excite Truck is a great game to pick up and play for 15 minutes at a time. There is no great learning curve and it's fairly accessible for non-gamers to pick up. In the end, it is a good solid attempt at creating a fun racer and it is well worth a look. Number 4. Sonic and Sega All-Stars Racing The tight controls and excellent track design ensure that head-to-head -head competition is always exciting. But it's so fun just to play around with these cars that it's easy to lose hours playing this title. All-Stars Racing may not push the genre forward in any meaningful way, but it builds so well on established themes that it doesn't even matter. Everything to play for as we enter lap 2! Number 3. Excitebots Trick Racing This is the fourth game in the Excite series, and it features a slew of fun mechanics and modes. There are additional modes that switch the races up, such as Mirror Excite, an unlockable mode that features harder opponents and reverse stages. Along with the handful of minigames that pop up during races, Excitebots has enough variety to keep you interested. Number 2. Mario Kart Wii Not only is Mario Kart Wii one of the best-selling Wii games, but it's also one of the most content-filled as well. As always, you are free to choose your favorite Mario franchise character and hop into a custom race card. A slew of multiplayer options make this a must-buy party game, sure to bring excitement to any Wii party. Number 1. Moto Heroes There are over a hundred unique levels to complete in Moto Heroes, and each one will have you exploring colorful and cartoonish environments. The main gameplay is less about speed and more about control, as you attempt to complete levels unsketched. In addition to the main story mode, there are also online and local multiplayer options. This title is definitely underrated. The economy was struggling. 